up everybody welcome back to another mole man episode we are uh maiden voyage on shannon's new yellow fin and uh hopefully we're gonna catch a lot of fish i got brayden yeah how's it going and he is the spear fishing king down here on the gulf so he brought some guns so we're gonna go to some rigs see if we can't spear some fish and uh just have a good time got sandal here he's uh up, guys? he took a lot a lot of dramamine <laughs> So hopefully it's not rough, but I think it's gonna be flat. Um, and we'll we're, we're running into a storm. So we'll see you when we get out there. Hopefully we catch some fish. The man put us on the fish. All the girls shot a fish, Shannon got a fish. Let's look in this box, got a bunch of spade fish. But uh, we're gonna hop in real quick and try to get a big cobia. So I'm gonna gear up, we're gonna hop in and uh, hopefully there's one here. I'm up to land. Is that a spear gun? A giant red snapper. But right under it was a huge stingray. So if I shot it, I would hit the giant stingray.
big rig stay here for an hour or two and see what there is we're going after anything there's a bunch of mangrove snapper here he said so hopefully we can get into some but this is a blast
Boxes loaded down. We had an epic day. Chance being, look at this. Ben caught him a big old cobia, and me and uh, Braden shot two big kings. Had a blast. Y'all go check him out. He's got some awesome Texas spear fishing videos. And uh, we're gonna head back, clean these fish, and we're eating good tonight. I'm gonna clean this beautiful fish that Ben caught. This is what we're eating for dinner right here. This is the good stuff. So we are back home from an epic spear fishing adventure. We had a blast. I'm cooking mangrove snapper because the cobia, I have it in the fridge or the freezer, but um, I'd like y'all to give y'all's input. It had like rocks, like it's some kind of parasite, but it's hard and they were like everywhere. And then there was like little tiny worms throughout all the fillets. So I didn't want to cook those. I want to figure out what's going on with that. May turn into uh, dog food, but 
Um, it just didn't look appetizing at all. So I've never seen that in a fish before. It's literally like little rocks that were in the meat. So cooking some mangrove snapper. We're gonna do a new recipe today. I got some couscous cooked over here and we're gonna do um, pecan crusted mangrove snapper. So we're gonna use some habanero jelly um, and just lightly put some of this on these fillets. So I'm gonna brush these fillets down with this habanero jelly, get both sides, and then we're gonna crust it with the uh, pecans and then cook it in butter. So I think it's gonna be good. I've never done this before, but it sounds really good. So let's see what it tastes like. Put more pecans on there. on there, put a little butter in our pan, get that melting down, and throw a little olive oil in there too, just to keep it from sticking. Um, and then we're just gonna lightly sear these, I guess, until, uh, shouldn't take too long. We'll put these guys in here. Let that sizzle up, and I'm gonna get this one crusted and put it in there, and then, uh, We'll do a taste test here in a minute whenever they get done. Right, so it definitely did not turn out the way I thought it would turn out, but hopefully it tastes as good as I think it will. All right, so we're gonna take some couscous. Ryder's not feeling good. He has uh, some teeth coming in and he's not very happy. But let's do a little taste test on this. All right. Let's try a little piece of this almond, not almond, uh, pecan crusted mangrove snapper. Some people call them mango snapper with a little bit of couscous. Well, I don't think uh, we've ever really done a terrible fish review other than carp. This isn't one that I would do again. That's not very good. I think it was the habanero jelly. I thought that would be good because I did it with the cream cheese and habanero jelly and it was amazing. But that with the pecans, I don't know what to say about it, but it wasn't good. I'm going to give it like a 4-2. Couscous is good. Um, that's about the good thing about this dish, but we're not going to let it go to waste gonna put it down it is mangrove snapper after all so um but yeah that is not the best rating i've ever had that's for sure hope oh, he just smoked it well do you like it oh you like it <laughs> Ryder gave it a better rating than i did Oh, and a smudge on the lens, sorry about that. But uh, had a great time on the water. Huge thanks to Shannon for taking us out on his new yellowfin and uh, Braden for showing us the ropes, uh, spearfishing the rig. So y'all go check Braden's channel out. It'll be linked in the description. Um, I'm gonna be at the ranch all week, so stay tuned. If you've been, if you've been looking for the hunting videos, they're coming soon. Hunting season's right around the corner. Um, and I appreciate everybody that has stayed with us. Make sure y'all uh, stay tuned, hit that subscribe button, share with family and friends, and remember, eat good.